Um, this is Rate My Gadget. So, uh, quite a few of you have wanted to know how it's easy to set up um, on the uh, Minix box as a TV box. So, um, this is the kind of basic screen that you will get. So, this is very similar to an Android phone screen. This is on my um, television. Um, so, the difficulty is obviously you won't have any touch screen. Now, the thing to do, and I'm just using the standard remote here, so going left and right, is this button here, uh, which is the circle with six dots, will get you to the apps, and you basically want to go to the Play Store, okay? And then in the Play Store, you want to search for two apps: one called TV Launcher, and one called Mizu, M-I-Z-U-U. -U. So if I show you TV Launcher first of all, okay? So TV Launcher, if I open that up, that's just an error I always get. Um, this is how I've set it up. So this basically is the screen now. So this is the screen which will basically um, allow you to choose and if I go left you can then add um, any apps that you want onto this. So as you can see I've set mine up. Now you can only get nine on there but I would argue that you probably only need nine um, and of those you know you might have BBC iPlan, Netflix, 4OD. Say So before going any further um, the TV launcher, you'll obviously want that to start up and always be your default um, starting operating mode. So this symbol here looks like a blue square, that one down there. You want to click on that which is your system settings. So this is your system settings, so you've got all various things, Bluetooth, Ethernet, all those kind of things. The one you want to um, go on to is... Uh, let me go back to it, apologies, is display. Okay, and in display you can set your wallpaper, font size, all that kind of stuff, but you want to go to default launcher. And default launcher will then have TV launcher, the app that you downloaded. If you click on that, <coughs> what it does is it opens up the TV launcher. Uh, that's an error that I get. Um, and this will always be your default setting for um, when you turn on and off your Minix box. I never turn it on and off. Right, so now the next app in order to turn it into um, a user-friendly TV box that you can watch your films on. <clears throat> so really the way I use this is you want the device, so as you can see down there I've got a USB drive that's constantly plugged into the back of my um, Minix and there's an app called Mizu, M-I-Z-U-U. -U. And what Mizu does <coughs> is it looks for the films on your USB drive and it'll um, give you these neat um, graphics. Okay. Firstly, you have to point the Mizu app in um, the direction of where your films are stored. So... Um, if you go to this icon in the top uh, right here, uh, not that one, that one that's got like a circle around it, then what you can do is configure the file sources to be included in your library updates. So select the file sources and then what you can do on here is in the top right hand corner is add where your file locations are. So you have to split it into whether it's a TV or a uh, TV show or movies. Um, so as you can see, I've got one which is my films, and then I've got one for TV shows, and I've got a separate one for all my Simpsons DVDs that I've put on there. Um, you can point it towards a local directory on your USB, um, which starts MNT slash USB storage. Um, or if you've got a NAS drive, you can point it towards your NAS drive. So you just point plus, you choose whether it's a movie, TV show, and where its location is. Then once you've done that, <coughs> so all of the files are in that folder, either MP4 or you know whatever format you've got, you hit Start Update. And then Start Update basically looks at your um, files, and it'll automatically fill in all of the details now it may well be that you've named a film incorrectly so let's choose 8 mile for example if it's not 8 mile um, I don't know it may we've called it 8 it thinks it's 8 mile but actually it's a another film 
what you do is you go into the film, choose a top right, and then go to Identify Movie. And in Identify Movie, you can then search for actually what movie is it. Um, so, <clears throat> so it's really, really user friendly. Um, and uh, TV shows, if you get to that point, go to the top left here and you can hit on My TV Shows. And it, again, TV shows are a bit difficult um, and I won't go into it here. There's a few blogs on it but you need to name the TV show. So say it's The Simpsons, you name it The Simpsons, S, which stands for Season, 01, E, which stands for Episode 04, so Series 1, Episode 4, uh, but there's a lot of blogs out there. Okay, I hope that's helped you um, turning your Minix into a fully uh, user-friendly um, TV box.